Yeah, boy. Ah! Hi, Snakies. It's me, Fifi, and I'm back. I'm back again today with another Kepala reaction for Jesus Christ. Kepala reaction for you guys. Kepala are back. Seven members. Seven members, and I heard a new concept, like a whole new concept. I am so excited. Listen, listen, if you know me, I'm a sucker for Kepler, okay? I love me some Kepler, but the fact that this is a, um, a concept change, and from the thumbnail, like I was worried concept change, are they gonna go like for like girl crush or something? I was really worried that that was gonna happen, but I shouldn't have been in doubt because I can see the thumbnail here. I can see the thumbnail and it's not giving girl crush at all. So yeah, I'm really excited as long as it's not disco. As long as it's not girl crush or disco, we're good. Um, the title track and MV is called Tippy Tap, which is the same title as the EP. I think I don't have it here. I think the EP is also called Tippy Tap. I'm sorry. Um, but I'll be listening to that over on Patreon. If you want to watch that with me, all you have to do is join the Ball Python tier. However, I will be sharing my favourite track off the EP here on YouTube, as long as it's not the title track. And yeah, I'm super excited. Let's just go. Disclaimer, I don't like to react with captions on as I find them distracting. I like to concentrate on the music and the music production is what I like to comment on the most. When I'm looking at the words at the bottom of the screen, I'm missing parts of the song, their vocals, and I'm missing parts of the MV and choreo. I'll read the lyrics later in my own time. Okay guys, let's go. Kepla, tippy tap, MV, let's go. Hold on, it was so loud, so I have to turn it down, but also that's literally three seconds in and I feel like I'm, I feel like it's about to be snakery and I'm about to die. Right here, where it goes more like bassy. 
drop that full sequence. What the actual hell? That's their best title track. Then I said it. That's their best title track. That was so damn good. And you know what? I felt like I'm getting bored of any type of garage in K-pop. I've been feeling it. It's getting there. I'm not completely bored yet. But it's getting there. This, though, I feel like... This piece of hair is tickling me. I feel like it was done different. And I feel like the garage elements in there were subtle. Like, it wasn't a garage track, per se. Do you know what I mean? Well, none of the K-pop tracks are garage tracks, really. But, do you know what I mean? It was just a sprinkle of it, really, in the chorus. And then it had housey elements, and then you had your bubblegum pop elements, and then you had your, just your pop elements. Do you know what I mean? Like it was lots of different fusion of sounds that just worked so damn well for me. That chord sequence in the chorus that I pointed out, um, I tried to sing along to it, was so damn good. The sounds, those synths, you had that deep house sound, that bong 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 sound. <laughs> I keep forgetting what it's actually called, but I love that sound so damn much. I feel like it was more prominent in the second verse. Um, the melodies were stunning. The visuals were out of this world. Out of this world visuals. My cup of tea. My cup of tea. I loved everything about that. They looked so good. They sounded fantastic. I'm obsessed. I've got nothing else left to say, to be honest, other than I just love it. You know it's a good song when I've got nothing to bloody say. I'm gonna head on over and listen to the EP. Um, if you wanna watch out with me, full Python tier. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, subscribe if you haven't subscribed. If you have subscribed, I love you. I love you. Gonna follow me on Instagram, guys. Gonna follow me on Twitter. More importantly, TikTok. I'm posting a lot more on there recently. I've been posting a lot more on there recently. Goodbye.